I Hate Your Deck would like to thank our sponsors, Card Kingdom, Dragon Shield, Altar Sleeves, and Moxfield. Please use our affiliate link for each sponsor to support us. I Hate Your Deck would like to thank our sponsor, Card Kingdom. So when you need the best prices on Magic Singles, Seal Product, Deck Boxes, or Play Mats, definitely check out Card Kingdom and use our affiliate link, cardkingdom.com slash IHYD. Using our affiliate link will help support our channel and helps keep the lights on. Thank you, Card Kingdom. If you really want to support I Hate Your Deck, there's a lot of ways to help support us. Number one way is through Patreon. Patreon is a great place where you get to join our community. We have a Discord where we play a lot of magic with our friends. And there's such a community of people from around the world in our Discord. So if you want access to our deck list, do you want to play magic with a lot of people from all over the world and interact or help brew your decks, the I Hate Your Deck Discord through Patreon will help you get all that done. Hey, check out these awesome I Hate Your Deck playmats that are now available for pre-order with my gold foil signature. I'd like to also thank the Dink List, our artist, that gives us unique alder sleeves that are I Hate Your Deck customed each month for our patrons. Click on the link in the description below and get 10% off these very comfortable Into the AM shirts. Use my code intotheam.com slash IHYD and come on, these trippy shirts are awesome. Hey, if you've been liking I Hate Your Deck, hit the like, subscribe, and ring that bell to get notifications when we have new episodes coming out. And as always, I'm going to keep dropping episodes every two weeks, and we also have bonus episodes. If you want to see those bonus episodes that were too hot for YouTube, join our Patreon to check that out. Wizards of the West Coast. Tapping out, slinging spells. I Hate Your Deck. We want to give you the true LGS experience. We show up, sling spells, and have fun. Now meet our players for this episode. Hey guys, welcome to I Hate Your Deck. This is Lynch, and as always, I'm with some amazing guests here. Oh. Not all of them are amazing, but some of them are. <laughs> Anyways, I love playing Paper Magic with my friends. Wouldn't know who those people are. <laughs> That's not me. <laughs> welcome to I Hate Your Deck. I'm award-winning science communicator and anthropomorphized Chewbacca, Kyle Hill. You know, here on this show, we like to play the decks that our opponents hate, but you love. And I hate your deck. We try to bring you gameplay with our friends who we really enjoy at the highest level. Give you a different kind of commander gameplay experience. Of course, if you want to have a different experience than just this video, you can go to Patreon where you can get the deck list, where you can get the first details on merch, new episodes, exclusives, behind the scenes content, you can even jump in one of the pods on Discord. Isn't that right, buddy? Yeah. I'm talking, shut up. <laughs> Today, I hope to have an amazing game. With people you know. With people I know. Isn't that right, buddy? Yeah. I'm not done! <laughs> Welcome to I Hate Your Day. That was all right, that was all right. <laughs> it was a good job. Okay. We, we're, you we're here too. Yeah, <laughs> it's cool. Who are you, wonderful people? He played magic like professionally, I guess. Once upon a time. What was your name again? I'd be shuffling <laughs> and shuffling. <laughs> now I mostly uh, take care of a radiant dog. And you live stream your gym when you work out? I do that. Hey, is that Brian Kibler over there? That's Brian Kibler. <laughs> Jeez. Are you Kibler. looking in the mirror? <laughs> <laughs> and, and we have wonderful <laughs> Olivia. Hi. Yeah, tell people about yourself. You I have mean, the cag and stuff. Yeah, tell them what the cag is. We mostly influence for Kamigawa. Uh, yeah, that too. We yell at the rules committee and they don't listen to us, but like they asked us to yell, so that's what we do. Cag, for those who don't know, is the commander advisory, advisory group. group. Yeah. Just a bunch Trying to of... make sure the game stays fun. For yeah, people. we try. Mostly get yelled at by people. Mainly, yeah. It's basically just taking some of the heat off Shivam on the internet. Yeah, everyone really goes after I him. Know, I don't know why. They like target him. It's because he's got a nice face. And sometimes when you're in a hole, you gotta stop digging. Yeah. Damn. Some people don't know how to stop digging. I gotta change. I gotta change some things about my life. Have you? That's my <laughs> intro. <laughs> Super All right. chill. So with that said, let's go into the pregame <laughs> rule zero conversation. <laughs> so heavy. Our rule zero conversation is sponsored by Moxfield. They have the best best. 
What did I say? The best big deck energy on the internet. You want me to, you want me to do it, buddy? Yes, yes go for <laughs> it. Today's Rule Zero conversation is sponsored by Moxfield. By far and away, the best way to build your deck online and share it with everyone that you care about, especially those people that you want to pub stop. You know what I'm talking about? Moxfield does not currently have an app, but what they're currently doing is sponsoring lovely shows like this. And if you support Moxfield, maybe one day they'll have an app. And I really love Moxfield, and I appreciate you guys a lot. Oh, hi, thank you. Thank you. And with that said, let's actually have the pregame Rule Zero conversation. What kind of experience do we want to have? Uh, now, I guess, spoil alert, we did end up talking about the kind of deck we wanted to play at a time. To just a time, little. Just, just a little, little bit. Uh, I'll go first. I'm going to play uh, Marchesa of the Black Rose. Uh, she's got a dethrone mechanic, so when I attack the person with the highest life total, I get to put a plus one counter on her. And, spoiler alert, she also gives other creatures you control dethrone. So a big part of this deck is to run loops and to sack creatures so I can keep abusing ETB effects and have fun with it. Well, you didn't say the, the, the big part of it. Whenever a creature you control dies with the plus one counter, return it to the battlefield under your control at the beginning of the next episode. A lot oh my of God, shenanigans. Spoiler alert. Shenaniganry. You know, well, that's why I said that they're looping. The looping, the way I snack sack stuff, there's a delayed just, trigger. He's just not and on the same it, page. Yeah, <laughs> okay. You're, what, tell you us a spoiler alert about a card we can all clearly read. Yeah. Right, thank, well, thank you. No, I know. I'm, I'm here. I guess I just like saying spoiler alert. I like to do this flicking the cards the way he likes to shuffle his cards. I like that. Yeah, give that to me. Right, well, I'm going to be playing Rith the Awakener. <laughs> Look at the bend you put in it. Boom. Thank you. He does. He bends the shit out of he his cards. He tries to tell me I'm lying. Wow, I'm lying. I, I just saw the bend on that one. Kibler is that his is, own grading stack. You can, if you under can, damage. This is this is the wow, yeah. That's the Kibler, the Kibler. Hey you man, know. he's got a ring. We don't. Gotcha. He must know something we don't. He be shuffling and shuffling. So this deck's actually basically just built around a bunch of cards that I played during my time competing on the Magic Pro Tour and in Grand Prix and such. Uh, every single uh, card in this deck is one that I played in a major tournament. It actually does have one card that is banned in Commander, which is Primeval Titan, because that's from my Pro Honolulu winning deck. And I had to include it. So are we all okay with the primeval type? I don't I mean, give a shit. I mean, yeah. Who's gonna argue with the, I with did, the champ? I didn't even put an Ink Moth Nexus in the deck because the infect like that, yeah. thing is kind of dumb. Yeah, that's a really cool, flavorful, flavorful idea for a deck. But I also think that a lot of people would, will like to hear some of the stories. Yeah. I know that last time when you were told stories about, oh, that played in my 1994 winning deck <laughs> or whatever. So that'll be cool to hear your stories too. Excuse about me, it was 1997. Oh, 1997. For fuck's sake. There weren't even tournaments tonight. I don't know this. But what I will say is, I'm excited though to hear a different. So cool. I know. <laughs> I'm excited to hear different stories about these cards. That means something to you. All right, Olivia, let's hear it. The Matrix I, wasn't even out. I know, right? Wow. wow. You know, I did a lot of mushrooms and went to the theater to watch The Matrix. True story. That explains a lot, actually. Spoiler. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I am playing uh, Cat Dad. My whole goal is to see if I can get to 44 billion scoot swarms because I've done it before sure. and I want to do it again. Really? Yeah. Are you good sick. at math? No, I'm not. <laughs> Someone on my stream calculated it out for me because I got confused. Is that what you do with your stream? You're like, hey, people in the no, no, chat, no, figure just, it out for someone, me. Someone, someone did it because they saw me clearly struggling. So yeah. yes, that's what you do. I'd be yeah. struggling. You just yell at them. Why would you have people watching you if not to do your work for you? Yeah, exactly. It's, true. it's kind of like you know asking your Twitter followers for advice, which became known years ago as Kibler Google in the. Magic Community. Huh. You gonna just flex like this the entire fucking time? Like, yes, that's the whole point of the deck. Tell us what you're playing yes. over here. Yeah, I'm playing hashtag cat dad, Lord Windgrace. Lord Windgrace. Also, I will just copy that ring. I will give everybody Hall of Fame rings. <laughs> I you have no idea what you've done. I want a Hall of Fame Like an ring. NFT. Yeah. <laughs> you may have the proof, but everybody else Are can have a copy. NFTs? Let's not get into that. Let's so, go. Uh, and finally, I'll be playing Yark the Desecrated, a notoriously strong kind of mid-range deck that uh, just grind out double ETBs until I find some sort of combo. Here comes oh. trouble, make it double. Uh, let's have some tea and Ooh, just a, a little mm. combo. Mm. Yes. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, yeah. do we all have our six-sided dice? Oh. I hate to work there. Now enjoy the show. I don't. Dice, uh, no, oh, I do. you, you are such a premature roller. Yeah, and? There's pills for that. I got a two. I don't need them. Five. Six. Fuck. Oh, 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 oh your premature work roll did not work for you this time. All right. Also Are you guys Gucci. Good? Yeah. I will. All right, take it away, Kyle. All right, let me draw. I will play a botanical sanctum, and then I will 
play a Birds of P. A Paradise, short for Paradise. And then I will pass the T. I'll draw for turn. <laughs> I got two T. I will play an Ancient Tomb. You should pack your bags, we can go tonight. I'll tap the Ancient Tomb. Okay. Lose two life. Yep. Metallic mm -hmm. Mimic. I'll say Wizards. What? Pass. Okay. Why are you staring at me like I care? Because, because last you time, about last time with the elves. I will play oh. a forest. Yeah, that's exactly. Why. Even though he was the one that said it, and I just. And I will play Bird of Paradise. It. Boo! Which was in many decks that I played over the years, but it was included as a single copy in my Pro Tour Hunter Lily so you're, winning you're, deck. You're wearing the same with Kamigawa's <laughs> Green Sun Zenith, and, and you both have Birds of Paradise. It's true. We, in fairness, he did just play a The convergence is like, It, it you know, is kind of weird. At the we're actually, we're actually like it, here. He didn't put his hair down. You got your hair down. Well, I want to differentiate myself a little. <laughs> I actually, before this game, told him he should just have his hair down. So it's <laughs> maybe it's Maybelline. Maybelline. He could do it right now. That's how he, hair ties work. He could. They I'm aware. They Maybelline commercials? Is that still a thing? Maybe it's Maybelline. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna play when this, I was born with it. I'm going to play okay. Tyga and Pat. Oh, Tyga. Uppercut. Tyga. Tyga. On top of your draw. Um, I will play a. Not as good as the Keebler with the shuffling stuff. As no, Keebler? Nobody is. You did say Keebler. The Keebler Elves. <laughs> Keebler Elves. Keebler oh, Elves. Yeah, that was last game. Uh, was uh, last I'll play game. a <laughs> Hellamar Depths, rearrange. Keebler. I'll rearrange the top three cards Hellamar. of my lib. <laughs> library, of course. <laughs> Anytime what are you I can make in Panama, I will. <laughs> R.I.P. Eddie. I will uh, pass the turn. Untap. I'll keep drawing. Rough for turn. Uh, <laughs> you had it, didn't you? <laughs> I'm more of a hot for teacher kind of guy. Okay. Okay, I'll play an exotic orchard. I'm gonna tap two colorless, lose two life. Because I like being at a low life total. We'll get I'll you there, buddy. I'll cast Talisman of Dominance. I'll tap these two, doesn't matter what color, because I'm playing a Demir Signet. That's a lot of mana. That's a lot of mana. Yo. Show, I'll hit you for <laughs> two. Okay, that's fair. Fair enough. <laughs> Let the blood feuds carry over. Game memory is a thing. All right, pass. There's one thing commander players should know is game memory. I will tap these and play Lotus Cobra, which also was in many of my decks, but most notably, Porto San Juan. What year? That was, oh geez, that was 2011. That was the block constructed Pro Tour for Zendikar. That's why I bought my I first play, red I camera. Played, I played Bug Landfall in that tournament. Uh, I will play Planes. I will add a green. Don't, don't bend those lands, man. You can't stop him. Oh, it's. Oh, 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 oh. And that will play he just bends the fuck out of him. He's like, I'm going <laughs> to. And do you see why when he was like, yeah, can I borrow that Yavin My Hall? I was like, let me find the one that literally has a chunk missing out of it. Yeah, go for it. Take that one. That's Least fine. main lion, huh? Yeah. Oh, I guess with 1 1. Counter synergy. Yay! Look it's how not a, it's the not a deck. It's, I'm just It's observing. a collection of cards. Fleece Mill is a 3 3. It has uh, Monstrous for green, white, 3. That gives it plus one, plus one counter and uh, gives it hexproof and indestructible. You were so delicate that last time. Stop. <sighs> just to tell you. I mean, it's a 5 cent card. I'll play a mountain. Do it with a dual land, then I'll. And I'll be like, whoa. He probably has. If you look at his Erd Dragon Have you deck, seen his Erd Dragon? My Erd Dragon deck has every duel in it. Like do the same thing. And, he like, <laughs> and he'll be sitting there like. <laughs> These cards aren't meant to be played. They're meant to be spiked up in price. <laughs> They're meant to be stonks. I'm going to pass. Untap, baby. Oh, I didn't see that coming. Um, I'm going to play an exotic Orch. Uh, for turn, I'm Zen Descartes. I'm Zen going to. Zendikar. Sorry. You got it. I know. I reel so it in. I know. <laughs> Those algorithms, man. I'm going to tap this for a black to play a dark ritual. Oh, shit. Oh, God, that's a pretty one. Yeah, I like that one. Is that foiled? Foil etched. This is just, it's, it's accents. Casting it's literally accents. just little tiny pieces. So what are you doing? You're casting so a commander? Yeah. Yeah, yeah don't tell anybody. Read and it for us. I will uh, use all of my floating mana to play Yark, the Desecrated Death Touch Lifelink. 3-5, the permanent enters the battlefield, and it causes a... a, a uh, it causes... I've Double never... ETB triggers. Thank you, jeez. <laughs> Graveyard, thank you. Graveyard, now! <laughs> Are you done? <laughs> wow, wow. Yeah, I'm done. Uh, I will tap this for a green, and I'll play an Elvish Mystic, and hey. then I'm done. Okay, untap. Jump, keep draw. I will play a land. I can do things. 
this exotic orchard, I actually picked up a Pro Tour Tokyo. I'm 49 years old. That's a lie, the only Pro Tour in Tokyo was in 2000, and that car wasn't printed yet. <laughs> oh, fact checker oh McGee over God. there. I mean, that was kind of impressive that you did that on the cover. I do know that, yeah. I played in it. <laughs> I'm out of my element. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna tell. I have nothing impressive to say. I'm gonna give you hell points for trying. <laughs> I have that nothing impressive to say. <laughs> but he can do voices. I, I heard. My precious. My precious. Like this throat thing he does. He like can do a lot of things with his you throat. Can do, he can do, can do a, do a lot, lot of things with his throat. <laughs> yes, yes. Okay. I don't know if he has a gag reflex or not, but you know, <laughs> he can definitely do a lot of things with his throat. Uh, he's got the daddy vibes, the long haired daddy Why vibes. Why are you going, continuing? I, I don't know, I don't know, I get nervous. Well, we're gonna go like talking. digging holes, <laughs> and stop. I and love that he's like, I get nervous and he's just staring at me like I'm going get, to help him. I get nervous and I say <laughs> terrible <laughs> things in a row. <laughs> I got well, really nervous you know, and I just couldn't think of anything but I talking about your gag what, reflex, I'm so sorry. Hey, I had to learn what daddy vibes were because people kept saying I had them and I thought it was because I was a dad. I didn't realize it was like a whole other thing. Oh no! Yeah, it happens. It's okay. We can learn stuff. We can admit we don't Why know stuff. Why are you looking at me for this? I don't know. Because <laughs> <laughs> you're the only one giving me eye contact. They're not looking, they're well, looking away. I don't blame them. Maybe it's my own fault then. <laughs> okay. I'm going to tap two, lose two life. I'm gonna then. Where are we? What happened gonna, in the last 30 seconds? I'm gonna then lose one life to go red. I'm gonna tap the talisman of dominance to tap the signet, uh, which that, gives man. me Marchesa, so she'll enter the battlefield. Because I chose wizard and she's a wizard, she'll get a plus one counter. Mm -hmm. I have one floating mana from the ancient tomb, and I'll just go ahead and cast a skull clamp. Oof. I will then go to attack. I will attack. God, you guys already have big butts. They cannot lie. Can't lie. lie. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, I have to swing someone with the highest life total, which is not Kibler. I will hit Olivia. Yeah, definitely. You just stared two. me in the eyes through all of that bullshit, and now you're gonna attack me? I've yeah. already been attacked. Well, once. but I, I true, <laughs> emotionally, emotionally, you emotionally feel attacked. Very much so. At least we're no longer talking about milking crater behemoths. You were tr you were trying to explain daddy to her earlier. Not me. I said I was learning what daddy vibes okay. meant. And you're still once again <laughs> staring <laughs> me in the face. <laughs> it's, hey, it's I will go learn. In. We have a daddy. <gasps> but you have daddy vibes. I don't I've been know. told. I've been told. You've been told you have daddy. Hey, it's okay. If we all have daddy Why vibes. Are we talking about this? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Certain people are gonna love it. You know, they're gonna be really happy. Yes, certain people will like anything. That's why 4chan exists. Oh, 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 oh. Take three, three damage. Big deck energy and deep. What are we gonna block with? I don't know. Jackass. Your face. Sure. Osaka, I'll, that's I'll go ahead and I'll, I'll equip Osaka. Okay. Mimic with the skull clamp. And it won't die because it's got the plus one counter from the DJ. The Rail. clamps. And I'll pass. Give them the clamps, boss. Yeah. Draw. All right, I'm gonna play Fable Passage. This is actually in my Pro Tour Charleston deck. <laughs> so basically, it's that like Kibler won't look at you, and I'm the next one in the line of sight. You're like, you're, like a, you're right in my eye line. I'm gonna add a red. Let the man play. <laughs> I'm gonna add a red, and I'm gonna play Oxida Scrap Melter. What is it? It's, 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 it's a 3 3. He when it, it enters the battlefield, destroy target artifact for four mana. Tell your story about this. So we're gonna destroy the Skull Clamp okay, while, while we're doing this. So this was the, the the basically the tempered seal pro tour where everyone mm. you know basically everyone played Artifact tempered creatures seal. Creatures get plus two plus two. Why didn't you? You do know that one. Of course and they do. there were a bunch of people who played red in that tournament trying to beat them with a bunch of artifact removal, including Oxida Scrap Melter. But mm. this card was actually horrible in that matchup because it was just way too slow. It and is, the the, poor, the key cards that match were actually tempered steel and ink moth nexus. So you just uh, like scrap melter like one of their creatures and then they just died all their tempered steel stuff. So a Story uh, someone was telling, like in one of those convenience stores, like in the, in Japan that are all over the place, mm -hmm. just happened to walk into the convenience store and someone was telling their friend, "Is like I, I can't believe it, I, I lost a temperance deal. I even drew two Oxida scrap melters. That's why it's in my deck because it's terrible." But it did no. just destroy my freaking <laughs> skull clamp. Oh, wait, I'm, not, I'm actually gonna. Am I gonna attack? I am gonna attack. I'm gonna attack Olivia. What's a better one now? Ingot chewer. Oh, there's there's a million different ways to destroy artifacts. that's better than that. It's uh, evoke. It's same. I think it's same. Yeah, ingot chewer is the. What? Well, that's five mana. It's five, it's five mana and it's evoke red. Oh, didn't get the colors. Don't want to get that attacked. Pass turn. What? Untap. 
Upkeep, draw. That I can cast. <laughs> She's like, oh, I knew it. I got my shit. Okay. Um, die, I will play that. I will then tap Elvish Mystic for a green and then a blue. I will cast a Neoform targeting. Oh, boy. Oh, Good. additional cost. I'll sacrifice Elvish Mystic to search yeah. my library for a uh, CMC2 creature and put a plus one plus one counter on it. I never do that. <laughs> you always forget, huh? I always forget. Reading the card does explain the card. Oh. Don't look at me, Lynch. You stare him in the eyes and take what's coming. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, okay. Whoa, and take what's coming. Okay, okay. He's okay. probably gonna give you a weird look. Okay, okay. You know, I'll have to go on another ayahuasca trip. I'm looking at him now. <laughs> But see, he looks at his cards. I mean, he's like, look, I look at him, he's like. <laughs> Maybe that's my problem. I put my hand down. I'll go on a journey and kind of self-discovery, you know. Uh, Bear Baleful Strix Ooh. into play. Yes. That's scary. No. Draw two it's cards. You have to draw yeah. two cards. Yeah. One more flying death touch. <laughs> nice little synergy with your commander. Wow. Is that how I sound? <laughs> Sometimes. Dang. It does get a plus one, plus one counter. Yeah. Which you are, you, you mentioned? I, I never do. I never do. I actually got the, I had the dice ready for you. I never do. Thank you, judges. ETB, always take care of your judges. We have two on set today. Hey. ETB on the stack, I'm gonna brainstorm. Are you? Yeah. So in, in one of my decks, I have a handwritten brainstorm. I have proxy. multiple proxies, oh, wait, you're which right. are just me with a permanent marker on a basic plane. That's, <laughs> That's why I was like, but why would you do that? Because I draw three streak. Three cards instead of two. But but then you just see fewer cards total. No, I draw three, put two back, then draw those. So I draw three instead of two for one extra mana. How? But you could have just drawn two and then brainstormed and seen more cards and had, had greater choice of the cards you could no, possibly I, have. I need them right now. Okay. <laughs> you could still get them right now and just see more cards. I wasn't at Pro Tour <laughs> Tokyo, you asshole. <laughs> I don't make these plays. I don't know. It, it, it's just a very fancy play to just do it worse. <laughs> He's calling you out, son. I mean, no, I gotta say, just, the last couple of times I've been like, on the show, it's been like a net <laughs> negative. <laughs> You're gonna do better, though. I believe in you. You've got great hair. Your hair is working. We can't even. We can't even show some of those episodes. He is shooketh right now. Oh, fully shooketh. But shooketh eventually goes into quivering. <laughs> Stop That's saying <laughs> words, man. <laughs> Dang. She called you shooketh. I just said if you keep going further down the ladder, it goes into quivering. <laughs> I don't make these rules. That's just how uh, it is. Lynch, I'm going to come at you with your arc. <laughs> really? Yeah. How big is it? It's a 3-5 death touch lifeline. It, oh, it is death touch, huh? All right, I'll take It's a quivering three. elemental horror. <laughs> <laughs> it's a quivering. It's not fun to quiver, you know, or shut You got to stop. You got to stop talking. <laughs> <laughs> For your own benefit, you gotta stop. I I'm tend gonna, to forget that there's okay. a benefit in life. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Oh, Jesus She's Christ. covering her mouth now. She's like, you know, she's doing the mouth cover. It's, yeah, cause you're, you're, you're getting a little. You were stepping in it, my guy. You're, you're getting a little wild, man. <laughs> I'm gonna pass so you can talk about your cards. Are you done? Yeah. Okay, I'll untap. I gotta, I gotta put, keep I, I gotta put my hair up and just, <laughs> and just focus. <laughs> Too much nonsense going on here. Okay. Let's see, oh what's the best way to do this? Oh my god. <laughs> so you still have genuinely three perplexing. Three, three. <laughs> okay, so I'm going. Oh, but I won't get I my trigger. I do not trigger. have the most life. Right, oh, he does, fuck. but he's got a death toucher. Well, <laughs> swing and um, scrub. All right, so I will. So Marchesa returns herself, huh? Yep. Yeah, yeah she does. That's really? Good. All right, yeah. so yeah, I'm going to. Fancy. Even I'll, better than I thought. This is only a 3 3, right? It is a three, I'm going to swing at you for four. Okay, I'll take four. Okay. Yeah, the Second main right phase. Shh. I'm going to tap two black. Okay, yeah, you got to figure I'm out bad. the app. It's okay. No, I'm, oh no. Things are hard. Life is hard. Well, you do. Just do your thing. Do your thing. I, okay, we, we but think, I'm gonna do We're something. I'm gonna do some shit. Okay. So I'm tapping two black. Uh, How much? Four. 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 I gotta lose a life for the uh, talisman, and I'm gonna lose another two life for the ancient <laughs> tomb, and I'm gonna cast now a, a controversial damnation. Wow. Destroy all creatures. Damn. They can't be regenerated. <laughs> do you have a response? I do not. I will pass priority. 
I will. Damn, what's he got? What you got in that box? Oh, I God, will. my abs hurt from that. <laughs> I'll tap three uh, to cast a ghostly flicker. Oh. Doesn't actually get around it. Um, so I'm gonna flicker Baleful Strix and Exotic Gorge. They both come back into play. I'm gonna draw two cards off of Yarrick, and then Damnation is gonna resolve. Okay. These will go on a delayed trigger to her uh, Marchesa's ability. So they'll be in my graveyard temporarily. Um, this Ooh. card goes there. I will go to my end step. They'll come back. I say wizards, and she'll get a plus one counter because she's a wizard. And I'll leave these two open because obviously I went into my step, and it's, your, it's all yours, Mr. Kibbler. He cracked his fable yep. massage. I got, a, I got a mountain. You got a mountain? Mm hmm. So <laughs> far, bent. That bent life. Hashtag Kibbler bent. He just opens his mouth and whatever man. comes out just. Hey, man. There's, there's no filter. I will play a Kasali Pride Mage, which was in my Pro Tour <laughs> Austin winning deck. <clears throat> I would like to make a tempting offer for the board. Throne of Lies. I will tempt with Discovery. You can search for your search your library for a land card and put it onto the battlefield. Each opponent may search his or her library for a land card and put it onto the battlefield. For each opponent that does that, I can do the same. And then everybody who searched the library shuffles. Are you tempted? No. Nah. Uh, Are you tempted? What? You have to show your first choice. Oh, okay. So you do what it. Do you mean? Yeah. You do well, it, and then right, yeah, you right. can repeat for each each other person. Uh, oh, it's a land card. Yeah. yeah. It's any land, right? Get a, get it is. Good. I know what I want, though. Any land? Yes. And then she does it for each one of us that also yes. do it. Mm -hmm. yes. I'll just start off with a command tower. I am not tempted. Okay. I want to see the fun stuff your deck does. I'll Great. be tempted. Okay. I'm getting a land. Okay. I'll get two more. <laughs> He's like, you assholes. <laughs> <laughs> Boo. The problem is, what, what do I need? See? Tempting. I'm going to get Temple of Plenty. All right, I'll do Command Tower as well. I'm gonna get a Temple of the False God and Luxury Suite as well. I'm gonna scry from my Temple of Plenty. Will you be done after that? Okay, so I got a Temple of the False God, Luxury Suite, and Command Tower, thank you. I'm gonna tap four for Mina and Den Wildborn so I can play an additional land on my turns. Uh, pay red, green, return to land from, to my... Hand. To my hand, and I can give it a trample, thank you. <laughs> As he says, it's late. <laughs> uh, hey, I'm the one who wakes up early because I got a kid that wakes no, up at Elon's five, six a.m. <laughs> See, that's where you messed up. <laughs> they don't wake up early from kids. Yeah, I wake weird. up early from, from my kid. Oh, yeah. dog doesn't wake you up? <laughs> oh, dog o'clock comes early. Pet dad. Um, I'm going to tap these because I feel left out on the mana train. I'm going to play a Kodama's Reach real quick. I'm going to put a... <laughs> Choo-choo, like motherfucker. That. Uh, I'm gonna put a swamp into my hand and into play, tapped. Uh, thumb and, I know, I'm not. Take a lesson from your alter ego over here. I wish I could play at the Pro Tour Tokyo. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Did you actually go to Tokyo play? Yeah. That was cool. I, I used to go to Japan every year because there was a Pro Tour in Japan every year. I wanna go to Japan. I'll tap Bot Botanical Sanctum for a green to play a Findhorn Elves and then I will also tap Exotic Orch for a green to play an Arbor Elf, and then I will pee the tea. I will untap Upkeep Draw. Organization, okay. yes. Everything at right angles, everything is in its right place. You're fine, it's okay. It's not 10.30 at night. I will tap an Ancient Tomb, lose two life. I will tap the Shivan Reef for blue. Lose a life. Shivan Reef? That should be the name of this podcast. I will cast a Sage of Fables. Each other wizard creature you control comes into play with additional plus one counter. That's useless to me. All right, I will swing at Kyle Hill, Mr. Hill. Could this will- another one. Okay, I, hold on. With the, the, the trigger, the trigger on, on the stack, I'm gonna destroy this. With the Sally Pride Mage. <laughs> oh, this crap's gonna keep coming back. Yeah. And back, and back. yeah. True. So, 
before that dies, this would have triggered and yeah. put a plus one counter on my Sage of Fables, and then the Metallic Mimic dies. Ooh. <sighs> so I'm just, you got pro toured. I got pro -toured. <laughs> This goes to two? Sure, I'll take it. Five. Yep, five commander boop, 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 damage. Boop, boop, boop. I don't know how to do the thing. She's got you. She's figured it out. Which one do you want to select? Or I don't know. There's there. too many. Oh, buttons. too many options. Okay. Decision paralysis. That's why Einstein only wore one set of clothes. Really? He decided, as he was formulating special and general relativity, that he wanted to take as many unnecessary ideas and decisions out of his life as possible, so he standardized or normalized his outfit. Well, did that, Obama did that too, right? He had his stuff all picked out for him? No, he wore tan suits and it was a huge scandal. Apparently, unforgivable. <laughs> yeah. yeah, but I think he had some picked up because there is something called decision exhaudit. Yeah, yeah, there is. Yeah. Oh, when you're there's like, there's like, when you're the president, yeah. Like yeah. Steve Jobs wearing so. the same I black turtleneck every day. His I'm gonna tap four, and I'm gonna cast Kess, Distant, Distant Mage. It's a wizard. Mm -hmm. It'll get a plus one counter on it. It's a lot of counters. And I will pass the turn. I guess it's a good turn. Untap. Draw. Right. Okay, I'm done. A, I was gonna use an aluminum wire. Do you know why I found out that all the command, the command zone is one place where all the commanders hang out? What do they do there? I'm gonna untap my lands. <laughs> See, I was, I was gonna, <laughs> I was gonna. You were gonna not, I wasn't gonna leave you hanging. She definitely did. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what. Yeah, she's. You, you know about this? No, you know about the command. All the it's like I'm one play area. Play Lord Wind Grace. I will. Wind Grok. You need Tick dice. up two, and discard this Opal Palace and draw two cards. Hmm. <laughs> what a poker face you have. Oh, it's dog shit. I have no poker face. <laughs> but conversely, the fact that I get excited about everything, people don't know what to read because sometimes I'll just like get really excited well. like a basic land and it's nothing of consequence. Hey, people want to see you do well though. I've seen many people that say, I want to see Olivia have a win con. <laughs> what fun is that? <laughs> <laughs> no, you got to bumble fuck into a win. That's the only way to do it right. Bumble fuck into a win. Yes. <laughs> is, uh, is that like a dirtily win? Yeah. Yeah. I'm like, oh, ta-da! Yeah. <laughs> Whoops. It's a win where nobody lives. <laughs> yeah, what the hell. I'm gonna tap two to That's play scary. Ren and Six. I'll plus one and return Opal Palace to my hand. Yeah, dog. There you go. Now you're doing things. Doing things and stuff. She said pass. I did. Cover that. That's you. Thanks. In case you want to play a On top of your draw. I do like the way he like the, the I did one not. hand spin of the cards on top. I like that all in one place. I literally took the Opal Palace back to play it and then just passed the turn. Um, I will play a waterlogged grove. <laughs> that was a choice. For the T. And then I will. I gotta look at my board so hard. <laughs> if they die, they will. Oh, I'm gonna. Not I'm gonna tap man. this, and I'm gonna tap this forest, untap target forest to add two green, um, and then I'm going to add two blue for four totes. Uh, I'm gonna cast a Soar of Temptation. Oh. Two two flying, when it enters the battlefield, gain control of target creature for as long as Soar of Temptation remains on the battlefield. Now you don't have to play against that cap. I know. Whatever. Thank you. And now you can Lame. play your stuff from your graveyard. Mm -hmm. He's always taking from me. It's true. This is such a theme. See, I looked at him this time, but then I felt your eyes pulling me over here. I felt the, the pull. So I'm going to tap a swamp to play a dark ritual from my graveyard. Ooh. Yeah. Exile it, add three, four, five, six, seven to play Yarrick the Desecrated once again. And then uh, once all that is done, I have no more game actions and I pass it. I will untap, draw, hope I get something good here. Because he's going to cast oh, Damnation man. again right out of the graveyard and that would have been... Oh, yeah, because I'm just luck. here forever. I would have loved that. <laughs> I will tap the Ancient Tomb, lose two life. I will tap the Exotic Orchard for black. And then I'll tap the Shivan Reef for colorless. I will cast a Disciple of Bolas. That's because good, it's a wizard, it will come in with the plus one counter on it. 
Um, when it enters the battlefield, sacrifice another creature. You gain X life and draw X cards, where X is the power. I will go ahead and sack the Sage of Fables, so I'll draw three. Seems decent. How many cards do you have? That, 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 sorry, this is you gain X life. Oh, and I gain X oh, life, sorry. I have a response. Okay. Oh. What? To gaining life? Now so what pro this is you play this, in? this yeah this is sacrifice to this this effect to this ability yes. right so with with this trigger on I'm going to punishing fire this what does that do it's just two damage but then I'm going to uh, actually oh I only have one red whatever I'm still gonna be punishing fire it because it's cool so oh, it kills oh it. I just saw that in a, in a legacy deck yeah so it kills it this is in my Peter Austin winning deck with uh, Grove of the Burn the Burnwell so oh. so it kills it yeah it dies yeah. so okay it goes I was gonna I, I was gonna like so it kill it and bring it back yeah. yeah yeah it's gonna go on a delayed trigger mm -hmm. yeah I was many, gonna bring it back but then I forgot that I didn't have one red mana whatever I have three I killed it I have a grip purified drinking water. It reverse osmosis technologies. Yeah, a little short here. <laughs> Tell you the membranes that they put this water through. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tap out mm -hmm. Tell's dominance, tap the uh, signet, and then I'll do the command tower for red. So I'll first I'll cast the goblin bombardment, and then I'll cast a mystical tutor. There was a, a dark side in the top of my what I would have drawn next turn if I had done this. <laughs> well. It wouldn't have gotten actually, you literally anything. Yeah, there's, there's, there's zero nothing. artifacts and enchantments. <laughs> in yeah, well, no, then know, see, I'm glad that it's not there. Just yeah, stack it at the top yeah, of the deck. Yeah. You know? All right, it's uh, fine. Show us why it needs to be banned. I'll just, I'll yeah, just grab a pack of negation. Step. It's fine. Okay. Oh, how do we make him tap out so he can't pay for it? <laughs> Wonderful. It goes to the top of my library. So I don't have it yet. Yes. Well, these are coming to play, and then this is going to trigger. Know. I know. Someone's a thinker. Someone's played magic before. Once or twice. A little bit, huh? No, he's talking about something else. Yes, yeah. yes, yes, yes. So I'll go to my top, my library. This will go here. All right, I'll hit you. Okay. For, well, hold on. Uh, yeah, I'll hit you. Sure. Okay. So five. five. And it's the same commander that hit yeah. me before, yep. so. Yep. All right. Then I will go to my end step where these will both come back. This will get a plus one counter. Mm -hmm. um, I'll target Marchesa. So she's five, so I'll gain five life. And I'll draw five cards. So, so this isn't going to come back until the at the beginning of my end step, right? Because it happened during your end step. Okay. And I had to discard. Yep. Yeah. Hmm? All right. I'll nothing. I'll put victimize <laughs> in the middle. Nothing. It's fine. Don't it's worry fine. about it. Uh, I will draw. Well. Nice match. It's like the only thing I can do. No. Come on! Oh, I want to go home. What are you doing? He's going to destroy all my creatures. I'm actually not going to destroy any creatures. I'm going to cast Armageddon. Why? Because <laughs> it's the only thing I can do. This was in my Pro Tour Chicago. I don't give a shit. <laughs> does, that, does that mean that's it's what you do? It's also a pretty beta Armageddon. So. <laughs> Listen, you can play a bunch that of lines every No, I don't want to talk to you right now. <laughs> that puts her way ahead. But... <laughs> that's what's He's got a pact of negation. <laughs> You're riding home with him. Though, you know. Am I? Oh, I'm fucking get Who are you? <laughs> Don't know. Do not look at me. <laughs> it's so pretty. It's beta. Shut up. <laughs> it's a bent beta. A Keebler bent. Uh, I have, Beautiful. I have no Kibler. response. I have nothing I can do. I said Keebler again. Kibler. Get fucked. Seriously. <laughs> Destroy your lands too. Get out of here. They're, they're gone. They're gone. You have no board. <laughs> okay, I'm done. All right, she, <laughs> did she comes back uh, and gets a plus one counter on her. He's having the time of his uh, life just, over right, well, here. Yeah, him. We just got Armageddon by just, the just, Kibler. Just chose violence. I did. I'm really excited to play all these cards in my hand. I can say I hate your deck. No, I just hate him right now. <laughs> <laughs> fucking deck. You're the one that chose to play that. I did. Because it was in my Pro Tour Chicago deck in 2000. <laughs> Just so you know. <laughs> oh man. You could return to the Wind Grache. Okay. I'm waiting for her to be like, get out! <laughs> you know? This happened to us last time I played with you. Oh shit, this is the second time we've been Armageddon on our show, huh? <laughs> <laughs> What the fuck? And, and not even by like a, a Narset, you know, with like a plan behind it. Yeah, there's no plan with here. <laughs> this was purely chaos. Yeah! 
guess I appreciate the story, but. What are you doing, Olivia? I am going to stay mad at Brian and play <laughs> a coarser grouping. <laughs> hey. So you're fine. Yeah, you're good. I will be. She just touched your deck. I, you're a father. We're deck masters. <laughs> you're a father. <laughs> think, think about it. I did both these things. I don't have any lands in hand. You can attack him for four. You can. But you can also just protect your planeswalker. So Shut up. Attack. <laughs> I won't hit I you. I won't hit your planeswalker. There you go. We're okay. all going to hit him. That good. <laughs> Untap, upkeep, drop. Um, I will. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> I have things I was going to do before her end step. Hold on. It's too late. It's my end step. <laughs> well, no. I mean, on your on your on your main phase oh, or whatever, I'm going to sack both Marchesa. You can do that on my end step. Uh, do your second main. So I'm just sacking both of these to Goblin Bombardment. I will do two damage to your Sour of Temptation. Well, which will then give me my Kess back. No, I got nothing to do anymore. And uh, then on your end step, they come back. That's my end step? Now yeah. it's on your end step. No, I'm telling you it's my end step, it's yes, not yours. It's, your it's your end step. Then they come back with a plus one counter on. I will then choose to sacrifice Kess, uh, which will go on the delayed trigger to that, so then I'll gain four life. And then I'll draw four cards. Now it's your turn. <laughs> On top of key draw, play this forest. Play this eternal witness with that forest returning. Uh, Two things. Neoform and birds of paradise. Um, then I'm done. I will, I will do something there. Uh, on your second main. You I should will, play Pact of Negation. Uh -huh, on your second main, I am going to sack both of these to Goblin Bombardment. I can just do that every turn. Yeah. That's part of what this deck does. Uh, and I will just hit your Findhorn Elves, and I'll hit your uh, <laughs> Arbor Elf. Sick. <laughs> <laughs> so do you want me to move them for you? Yeah. Yeah, like you have issues. All right, I'll put them over here for you, and I'll put them nicely the way you do. Like You have this nice little setup over there. Who cares? I'll just buy more. OK. <laughs> and then on your end step, all of these come back with plus one counters on them. Um, and I'm I'm not gonna I'm gonna ignore that trigger because I don't want to be too high in life, so I can attack you. Well, you can't. It's a, you have to do it. Oh, I do. I have to. Yeah, do you it. have to sack huh? it. Wow. I'm just gonna deck yourself. <gasps> Good. All right. I guess I'll do cast. Let's try to win by attrition. So I'll gain four life. I'll draw four cards. Okay. Wow. And I'll untap. And then I'll draw for turn. Does anyone? Fucking arm again. <laughs> well, I just. Has anyone scooped on your show before? <laughs> no. You're not going to start either. You're, you're good at magic. You're that close. You know, I, you I, have, I have had a lot of abuse from you on this show, and I've took it. I took it like a man. I didn't do nothing. I fucking pro toured, and then all right. <laughs> sitting here. Yeah, look, hey, you got no mana to do all this card stuff that I'm getting all this advantage, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so I'm going to play a sulfurous, sulfurous springs. Go ahead, you go. No, you can no, play. no, I don't Do even it. want to. I don't don't even, give him this outside. I don't even want to. It's not on your con I don't. Science. I don't even want to. <laughs> not on your con science. Don't even want to. No, you've lost the will. Don't even want to. Where's my phone? <laughs> okay, how many how many cards do you have in hand? What? What do you think? You know what I have in hand. You heard me ask. Well, then why do you care? I have six. Okay, so I'll do that. I'll tap. I'll Jessica's will. Oh, right, I have my commander out. I get to do more than just get six. Mana. This is special. It's it's fun times. All right. So what is it? I get to exile of three cards. I may play them this turn. All right. So oh, land. Okay. Oh, sneak attack. Necropotence. Ooh, sneak attack. They get haze. That is not bad. And I have, I have. Okay. So I'm gonna cast sneak attack. <laughs> I gotta pay for it though, so it goes down to two. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna pay one, and I'm gonna put Flare the Hate Bound. 
Is this what we get for all wearing the cool Kamigawa sweatshirts <laughs> without him? Like, <laughs> and I'm gonna talk to them, and they'll never send you one of these. <laughs> <laughs> He's a terrible influencer. Brand ambassador, oh, my ass. Oh man. <laughs> All right, I will also go ahead and if I'm falling play another frame, one, it's fine. Trust me. All right, I will do. <laughs> I'll do a sad robot, just, solemn, just solemm sil looks single hour lower, alacrum. Yeah. Will come into play. I will search my library for basic. I only think I have like one basic in here. Oh, good. Is there a sure. combo I'll, with Flare I'll, the Hatebound that I'm not seeing or something with Goblin Bombardment? Can you just kill us or? I'm trying. Okay. This Which creature is the when it dies in the plus one counter, it comes back. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 100%. And because of the whole sneak attack thing, it's kind of cool. They have haste. All right. So. I'm so far ahead right now. Oh my God. All right. I'm going to swing at these three. One, two, three, at you, cause you only because you have the highest life total. I, I, nothing personal. Um, <laughs> and then I will swing these two at, at Kibler. So okay. Marchesa and Disciple Bolus at Kibler, Sage of Fables, Flayer, the Hatebound. So these will get plus one counters on them. I buff someone else's creature. <laughs> three, eight, 11. So 11 at you. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, right, the right. The D-throw right. mechanic. Yeah. Yep, yep. I will go ahead and I'll sack these two to Goblin Bombardment. I'll do two damage to... Choose wisely. <laughs> <laughs> that sounded like the Indiana Jones. Choose wisely. That's what it sounded like? Yes, it did, yes. Have you you sound like an old that knight part's... in a cave. That part's fine. I'm just wondering if he knows what inflection is. <laughs> I don't know. Now, hey, <laughs> judge question. Hello. Does this do Planeswalkers? Yeah. Yes. Any, any, any target. Any All right. Target. I'm just gonna do two damage to your yeah. wind grace. All right. Then I will go. Oh, but well, this died though. I should have drawn a card. Then I go to my end step. Clean up. These three come back. Only one of them, because one of them's a wizard, gets the plus one counter. On it. When flare another creature comes to battlefield, deal eight damage equal to the player. It's two, six, ten. Oh. Okay, 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 okay. With Flare the Hatebound and Marchesa, you can do how much damage on everyone's end step? Or before each end step? Total? Um, Six, 17 damage on everyone's end step. So, ab about that damage. So, I, 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 I'm not gonna have anything to do with that, man. <laughs> okay, well, well, for now, I'll do 10 damage to you. To me? Yeah. Okay. You can oh, take you have the highest life total. I got eight. I need some, oh, yeah, I should hit myself soon, huh? And then, yeah, so now it's your turn. Oh, I got a discard though. Who have a land? And I'll, uh... I'm done. You're in a Before conundrum of your <laughs> own making. <laughs> Before he's done though, I'm going to sack Flare to the Goblin Bombardment, do one damage to you. It's gonna die, immediately come back, with a plus one counter on it because of the undying. And then it saw itself, and I'll do another four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, I will then sack one, two, three, four, five to gum bombardment, and I'll do another five damage. One, two, three, four, five. These will all come over here on his end step. They'll all come back. Ex yeah, they'll all come back. Um, and then. This gets a plus one counter, this gets a plus one counter, this gets a plus one counter. Do you want to go through the undying thing again, or are we good? <laughs> well, we're, hold on. Then I have to figure out how much damage I'm doing again. 18 damage. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, I have a gift from Game Night. Then I do one, two, three, four. I draw four cards. About so then Flare will come back with the plus one counter. And I'll do another, I'll just do five here. Okay. Let's get the plus one counter. Now I think. Oh, now you're putting the ring I back on? I think I've resolved oh, everything, right? Now we can go to your turn. I do player removal. <laughs> oh, if I had enough mana, I could. Hey, look at that land card. Right, I want to so hear this... you existing right now. <laughs> like, <laughs> just... I think that was Kyle. Yep. 
Kyle goes up. Sorry. Thank you. Thank you, judges. Appreciate you guys. What? Bombardment? What about What do I ask trophy? That's what's allowing him to do that every single turn. Get fucked. All right, hold on. No. In response. Oh. I'm not holding. I'm doing that. <laughs> I know, Hurry but I'm up, able to do I'm going to continue taking right, game action. I'm going to sack four creatures doing four damage. I'll do four damage to your face. I don't care. All right, and these will all go on a delayed. And then this guy's, right? What does it say? Does anything yeah, else happen? You, get, you, you can get search basic. for a basic. Okay. I will plus one, run in six, return Temple of the False God to my hand and play it for the turn. Is it tapped, the land that comes in? No. Well, I mean, she kind of saved a lot of you guys there. You're not that nice. You have really nice hair. Hey. Your back ear, the ice just got so thick. <laughs> wow. It's that easy, huh? When you got hair like that, you know? You gotta hide it in a brand ambassador hood. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you said brand ambassadors were like the bane of your existence. <laughs> they aren't. They're the lowest. They are until the you. No, 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 no. I. No, of course not. <laughs> <laughs> you two want to play the most popular trading card game on? I'm the gonna planet. play the Gitrog Monster. <laughs> Ooh, be spicy. Those were the death stick. <laughs> it was. She was like, good eyes. You're dead. Okay. <laughs> I deserve that. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Hold on, how are you? <laughs> He's, I'm at I'm three. killing him with Mina and Den, oh, which is a four. Sorry, he can't sorry, block sorry, with sorry. the land. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so then all my shit yeah, comes back. <laughs> so these all come back. Kes gets a plus one, this gets a plus one, this gets a plus one. Do you know what undying is? <laughs> you know, you gotta learn in life sometimes. 12, 13, 14, 15, so 15 damage. I'll go ahead and kill Kyle. Okay, you can keep my deck, but. <laughs> <laughs> okay, then, then I will target, I will, I will target Flare the help uh, of the hate mound. With the Cyber Bulls, it'll come back immediately. It'll come with a plus one counter on it because of the thing. I'll do five damage to Olivia. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> Just kidding. I like I will also gain <laughs> one, two. Don't touch it. Three, four, and I'll draw four cards. So mm. All right. And then that's the end of your turn? Or you did, what'd you do? Is that what, what are you doing? I was just. That was her end step. Yes. Okay, so it's my turn. All right, I will draw for What turn. dimension did I enter? I don't know. <laughs> I'm making sure a lot of things are happening right now. Oh, just, keep, just make sure not too loud. So we're, we're finishing game actions. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all playing, right? <laughs> Do your sack and bring it all yeah, back. It's not game over. Kill it. You got rid of my sack. Oh no. Play. That is the problem, and I don't have a. Mm, I don't have a search right now. Good. I need to do something. Oh, actually, oh, I could do that. something. Just attack her. <laughs> well, how much does she have? She's a 15. All right, I'll swing out. Jesus fucking Christ. I'll swing out with this. So I'll swing with a hate bomb. does have a 6 eight. Cast uh, Disciple of Bolas and Marchesa. Okay, I'm going to get Marchesa with the Gig Rag Monster. Death okay, touch. yep. And then and is she's it? what? She's not oh, big enough. I don't care. So she's, she's dead. Yeah, she'll die, but she'll come back. But hold on, this is all still. Deciding which one I want. And I'll honk uh, Bolus, Disciple. Okay. Crew fix. So then you're taking yeah. nine damage? Sure. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then just. Yeah, I mean, you were doing it the whole time anyway, so just. And then just. And then they come back. And so then, hold yeah. on. Yeah, these these will go. Just attack uh, her. <laughs> well, I still have, I still have stuff on the But these no, just kill her! Just kill her! Just kill her! What? Oh this comes God. back, this comes back, she does! Right away? Yes! Yes! All right. I'll fine, I'll go to my, I won't pass any, I'll go to my hand step. And they'll Can come you not back. see <laughs> this? <laughs> and, and that's this. But that's, that's not that much. It's it only doesn't four, matter! Five, She's a five! Six, She's a six! Oh, I got seven. Jesus I also, you know, there you go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Hey! 
<laughs> you know, I, I could just cast Psychotic Rift. Stop know. it! There you go. It's Italian, though. Italians are special. What oh. words are you saying? <laughs> what are you looking at? Well, oh. hey, thank I you don't, guys. I, I, don't have, I don't have a search. He says with you Insidious... You cast and play! No, but those Insidi are my... Those are my... In Insidious Dreams, Vampiric Tutor, <laughs> Jessica's Will, all of that in your oh, graveyard cast, yeah, with right. that. <laughs> It's okay. I wanted to have fun, you know, I was playing with, with my food. With all those triggers, you're drawing two extra cards off every single... Oh. Well, this, this is... <laughs> ah! Well, at least Marchesa got to finally do Marchesa. It's a good deck! It's, it is It is complicated. Yeah, there's a lot going on. Oh, there, there is I, a lot going on. There's a lot going on. I will say we did circle back to the Undying thing like four times. <laughs> and you just did not understand it. Well, I kept forgetting if it had the counter or not had the counter. I, mean, I, I know, I was it. there, I know. You know like, no, no, I remember. I was like, wait a minute, was there a counter? No. Or wasn't there a counter on it? Did we you even know? play magic today? It was like <laughs> mostly just yelling at each other. Right? I mean, that's why the episodes are yeah, great. Now, did you feel the pregame oh. conversation worked on this? No! Well, well, to be fair. Armageddon! I didn't know he was just playing bullshit cards. Yeah, I told you! The Armageddon? He cards I mean, when he did Armageddon, I, the only reason What was the story for that one? That was the card that was in my, my <laughs> uh, first Pro Tour Top 8 deck in Chicago in 2000. Did you win that Pro Tour? I got third. Good. <laughs> okay, fine. Oh, well, that was a game. <laughs> I enjoyed having you. That was a game. That was Thank a couple hours coming. that we sat around the table sorry. and put cardboard down. You, you're gonna I'm... win one day. <laughs> 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 if you also hated our decks like we hated each other's decks, make sure you're liking, subscribing, going to Patreon, getting all the additional benefits that everyone I'll in the I hate. The don't you I hate your deck. Me. I'm trying to leave. <laughs> Get all the other benefits that the I Hate Your Deck community gets, and uh, and maybe uh, I'll see you there. Okay, show's over. Bye bye. He does okay. Shit in our Discord. Okay. He's great. there. Okay. He's... Great. Cool. Thank you. Say hi to him. Thank you. All Discord. right. Okay. Bye bye. Hey, hey, you forgot your deck. It's okay. Keep it. Okay. I'll take it. No, I have you no. Won't. You want to no. split it? Get we the hell split. out of here. No. What? Rock no. paper scissors for who gets his no. deck? No. 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 You get it. Women's yeah. first. Let's cut. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> We'd like to thank our sponsors, Card Kingdom. I Hate Your Deck would like to thank our sponsor, Card Kingdom. So when you need the best prices on Magic Singles, Seal Product, Deck Boxes, or Play Mats, definitely check out Card Kingdom and use our affiliate link, cardkingdom.com slash IHYD. Using our affiliate link will help support our channel and helps keep the lights on. Thank you, Card Kingdom. I'd like to thank our sponsors, Dragon Shield, who I feel makes the best sleeves in the market. I've personally used them forever, even before they sponsored us. Check out Dragon Shield and use our affiliate link. It's another way to support us. We'd like to thank our sponsor, Alter Sleeves. Alter Sleeves ships worldwide, and again, if you use our affiliate link, you get 5% off your entire order. And in addition to that, they also have a Mythic Gamings that are also sponsoring us, where we're also going to be selling more playmats and things from. And I'd like to also thank the Dinklist, our artist, that gives us unique Alder Sleeves that are I Hate Your Deck custom each month for our patrons. I'd like to thank our sponsor, Jeffrey's Comics, for hosting I Hate Your Deck here at their LGS. Not only do they sell magic product, but they also have a lot of amazing comics here to check out, and they've been around for quite some time. So definitely give Jeffrey's Comics a stop by if you're in the area in Torrance. I'd like to thank Moxfield for being a sponsor and sponsoring our Rule Zero of I Hate Your Deck, the best deck building uh, website that there is, and the fact that you can also play test hands and the deck is pretty incredible, and they also include primers. They're definitely innovating in the deck building community. If you want to support I Hate Your Deck, please consider joining our Patreon. It's an excellent community that we have built with people from around the world where we play magic in our Discord using Spell Table. If you haven't had a chance to play online magic yet, try out our Discord. It's a great community where people are gaming daily. And every Thursdays we have Commander Day where people play all day and night, but the community's gotten so big, Commander Day is almost every day at I Hate Your Deck. I play Magic the Gathering as a member of the I Hate Your Deck community. It's a place where I can get that local game store experience um, online. Nearly any night of the week, I can grab a Commander game. 
um, during my evening hours. I can talk deck tag and share deck lists, talk about upcoming releases and other fun things with passionate players. And most importantly, I can create a connection with other humans while playing a game that I enjoy. That is why I play Magic the Gathering as a member of the I Hate Your Deck community. My name is Lynn, and I'll see you on the battlefield. Hey, it's time for the Patreon shoutouts. I'd like to thank Aaron Gover, Mac Ox, and Michael Rocha. Thank you. If you want a shout out, you need to be a tier four or tier five patron where we give shout outs. Now we love all of our patrons, but it's just one of the perks of being a tier four or tier five patron. Without you patrons, we wouldn't be where we are today and we wouldn't be able to keep making content. So thank you so much for helping us make this show a reality. And we're really excited to keep bringing you great content for the years to come. I can't wait to be able to bring my son on the channel once he gets old enough, let me tell you. When we filed our taxes earlier this year, my girlfriend claimed me as her dependent. What is it about you that she finds so intriguing? Just so you know, I am an actor. You are making me want to kill myself. You're not a work actor. In this relationship, Alice is the breadwinner. Hey! I got a job for a very big producer in Hollywood. What are you doing? I'm going to watch her kids. <laughs> oh. You know, men are really simple. They need to be propped up. I'm not her dependent, just, you know, man to man. I also give her very good sex, so we're doing just fine. It's kind of embarrassing. Just saying. Intro and outro music by Hollow Brooks. Background music by Sakura. Music by Trapdoor Social. Our friend Skylar Funk is the lead singer and avid magic player. I hate your deck. Los Angeles is the sunny home of we the wizards of the West Coast. And the guests we fuck with on this epic show. I hate your deck! Guitar solo! Competition is toe to toe. From Cash's Mars to fucking Post Malone. The best commanders and the lowest blows. I, I hate, hate your death. death. We're on a roll. <laughs> black, black, wow! So attack, play your cards, and say go. Be you white, blue, black, red, green, or gold. It's a counter spell? What's the deal, bro? I, I hate, hate your death. death. Now enjoy the show. your deck. Join the I Hate Your Deck Patreon exclusive Discord to get the various benefits and be able to play Commander daily with people from around the world in our global community. We'd like to thank our sponsors, Card Kingdom, the best place to order singles or sealed product. Dragon Shield is the best sleeves to protect your cards. And Altar Sleeves, the place to get cool altars without damaging your cards. Please use our affiliate link for each sponsor to support IHYD.